Lalita Lajmi is a veteran printmaker and a self-taught artist who continues to paint in her Lokhanwala home at the wise age of 89. Her creative oof traverses over five decades and counting and includes etching and printmaking, pen and ink drawings, oil color and watercolor paintings. Her work navigates the humane predicament and contains elements of an autobiographical narrative with the continuous presence of psychoanalysis. Born into a creative household, Lajmi's brother was the great filmmaker Gurudath, her mother a polylingual writer and her father a poet. She developed an interest in art at the tender age of 5 when her uncle BB Benegal, a commercial artist from Kolkata where Lajmi grew up, bought her a box of paints. Lajmi continued to nurture her love for art once she moved to Mumbai where she studied commercial art at the Sir JJ School of Arts. However, her painting career began much later in the 60s when she would also teach art in school to earn a living. Lajmi's body of work revolves around the themes of death, performance and the complexities of human relationships. Her close association with cinema and theater resulted in the use of mass as a recurring motif. She also believes that we all don't mass in real life. While the ominous shadow of death breathes heavily on her works, with titles like Death Reading a Book of Poems and Death of a Mask, her prints are also introspections of the subconscious mind and its dreams. While her earlier works are melancholic in nature, her latter works are described as more optimistic. The key highlights of the Princess Auction include Lot 3 The Mask, Lot 24 Death Reading a Book of Poems, an ominous work highlighting Lajmi's interest in poetry and the preoccupation with death and the subconscious mind. Lot 39 Portrait of Gangubai, famed for lobbying for the rights of commercial sex workers and one of Mumbai's well-known and influential brothel owners in the 50s and 60s. Lajmi drew this detailed work in 1982. She knew Gangubai personally and said she was Kalpana, Lajmi's daughter's caretaker, and would often prepare meals for her. Another highlight is Lot 65, untitled, portrait of Navjot Alta, Alta Mohammadi, Gogai Sarojpal, and Lalita Lajmi, amongst others. Lajmi's work in the mid 80s and late 90s comprised etchings, oils, and watercolors depicting the inner conflicts in human relationships. One of them portrays the natural bond between a mother and daughter, probably drawn from Lajmi's relationship with her late daughter and filmmaker Kalpana. Works from this period also explore the latent tensions between men and women.